All right, there we go. How's everybody? Welcome to today's Valorant Bedway Battles of Fall 2023. My name is Simply Q1. I am joined by Lumi. Hello, hey, hello. Hey, hey, there we go. There we go. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. We have an exciting game today. We got Howard University versus Long Island today. But uh, the reason this one should be the de the decider, yeah. As the decider, like you said, the decider today. Like it's either go big, go home. Winner moves on to the single elimination bracket next week where the loser, oh, they're going home. Like, well, they're already home. They probably just won't be here <laughs> for the rest of the tournament, unfortunately. You know? A little bit so, more depressing of a home trip. Oh, yeah. No, like, definitely going to go to bed unhappy. But, you know, like, we wish wishing both teams equally good luck. Um, it's going to be an I'm exciting match. But, yeah. Absolutely. And then, I mean, from what I've heard, you know, Howard seems to be the fan favorite, but I'm always rooting. That is true. That is true. And right into it, we have the map selection already. Howard deciding to ban Ascend. Long Island banning Split, giving us a nice Haven first map. Okay, I like this. I mean, Look, Haven's Howard. a pretty safe one. I mean, the, the comp's been reclined pretty much indefinitely. It's in the same boat as uh, at least Ascent for me. Mm. If, if you're it's going into Haven, you see this first map pick and you're... Uh, you're Howard. How are we feeling? If, if we're Howard, I feel like, you know, like... You, you, who did you say was the fan favorite? Who did you say was the fan favorite? Howard, Howard? Howard looks like fan favorite based off of Seed, at least from the info that I, mm. that I have. But Long Island going into this, I mean, you see that you see the Haven pick. It's a tried and true. I feel like we got to be confident. Well, I feel like Howard is definitely going to pull out something out of the pocket here. You know, like looking just at the hovering, we have a Viper Omen coming in. The more yep. experimental, roughly similar. yeah, it's it's yeah. kind of rough, roughly similar to something I've seen in like the GC scene a little bit. I know Harbor Vipers kind of uh, at least was dominant for a little bit on uh, yeah. on Haven, and I've I've personally tried it myself. It's a pretty strong comp, but the the meta's meta for a reason, and sometimes you really shouldn't struggle with it. If you have that is exciting because the thing is, what you said right now, meta is meta, and it looks like Select it's going to be meta agent. into the experimental comp, in my opinion. But I'm always excited, you know, like I'm always open to new ideas, to new play styles, you know, like maybe they do something that we can learn from, you know, like something that exactly. it blows us all away, you know. The, the only real way to beat meta is either to play meta better or find <laughs> something that breaks the meta. And I honestly, you know, I'm, I'm a big fan of seeing off meta comps, so I'm really excited to see how this goes. Oh, no, it's crazy. And then the thing is, oh, I, okay, okay, Howard, I see you. I see those matches. Gotta Title be some cards. kind of Power Rangers buff. Oh, they go into this. A... They got the buff already. <laughs> That's a big buff coming in here. But no, for exciting for myself, you know, first time casting one of these games, for especially for these teams, I'm excited to learn more about these players and how they play. Like, see who stands out, who does more support plans, and things like that, you know? Learning the players. Absolutely, yeah, no, I get you. Uh, one thing I've noticed already off rip is Howard's coming in with the, uh, the full matching user. That's gotta be uh, striking a bit of fear, at least in my opinion. Always good to see that formality. Yeah, no, that means structure is in play, you know, like probably playing together for more than 30 days. They probably. The restriction <laughs> yeah. on changing the names and stuff. But no, we see the KJ, of course, putting up nice flank traps. What it's, do you think, though? It's looking like a really strong mid fight here, at least off rip. They're not really setting up anything for Seaside, but at least on the side of uh, Long Island, it looks like they're reading this pretty well, at least off rip. And it seems like they might try to get this um, power going for the B push. And guy Interesting wall. I don't dead. think they have a this one before. Big opening. Enemy kill. Balling in. And then, of course, Rudy ran to save the silver. Really big refrags out of both teams. And it's it's almost as if the picks didn't matter in the first place. The trades are over and we're basically back on it. I feel like Long Island had a good read to what happened, but unfortunately Howard had more people to set off each other and then just take that ice side quite easily. Especially Very with well that played. Viper wall, I mean, they were able to funnel pretty much on a B side free, and it looks like at least in the free round that was their goal in the first place. Was to go mm. from the oh, I like this Viper, you know, like just denying all this info, making it hard for these two to retake on A side right now. 
And they yeah. still have the turret up, so they, they know they can't be flanked. And just the, the double up here in short makes it extremely hard, especially with the Yeah, no. One enemy in the city has this pose so set up so well. They have so much delay. Well played by the Viper. He knows he has to save him. Oh. I mean, a really, really strong first round, and I'm, I'm liking the way they're playing Viper. I mean, they're isolating the angles, allowing themselves to funnel on, and even, even if they didn't originally go on to be where the wall was originally thrown, you can just chill and hold off any Raj push. That is true. That is true. I do want to ask you a question. Are you currently having fun? No, I, I'm, I'm not currently having. Fun. <laughs> I, I can't hear the timer or anything no, like that, but it fine, seems like fine. Howard's is going to take this straight to see. We have the KJ. Long Island is reading, the KJ is reading the right plays at the moment. I mean, but there is only so much you can do, especially with a full five funnel, and, and no gun to play off of. They are just no. running down. Ah, and I mean, what really down. can you do there? Yeah, and, and you know, this guy does have the right idea, try to fight with the team, but there's not really a lot you can do. And with the man disadvantage as well as the eco disadvantage, this is kind of just a funnel out play for exits type of game there's not really much they can do here. you know long island is just gonna have to try to see what they can get out of this you know like some eco picks would be great for economy wise but as of right now i do like them stacking up trying to take it out together but the information uh, one, one enemy remaining that knowing that they're all in the really really clean round i mean one pick that's not as much as we're hoping for especially with we can assume at least one or two players on the side of long island at least the share it's if they didn't that's kind of shocking but there's eco damage on their side as well yes, i feel uh, like this is has the potential to be a really strong bonus especially with the way they've been playing this comp they're isolating their fights well they're not really they're not peaking anything without an intention right they have the util mm. to follow it up everything has been well thought out at, le at least the first two rounds I'm, I'm really looking forward to see how the buy rounds go into play well, if, of course, right now, Long Island has the area. a full buy coming into this defense round, so hopefully they can pull something out here. But, like, just look at this Viper, you know? Like, the Viper wall was B last round, now it's C again. I mean, A, sorry. It's just, like, consistently swapping up, giving Long Island no idea of what this Viper might be doing, you know? Like, what's the play for them? And and especially with Viper being such a readable agent at a, at a face level, if you're throwing your wall the same way. Going up. Especially in the pre-round, you're giving up, you know, these, uh, these, this information before the game even starts, right? But they're doing a really good job of being as unreadable as possible. The only issue is that right now they really have to find an Get opening, out of my especially way. when down the gun advantage. Yeah. But with the but... Omen and Jet lurking up A long, they can find a very big <gasps> opening pick. Big, big, big refrag. And the fight's going down still, Silva is on site. And ballin, ballin, ballin is ballin. <laughs> Absolutely, ballin is ballin today, and it is still looking really strong for the retake for Long Island. I, I, I do think they can win this if they yeah. play this game, It's definitely not an equal, an equal playing ground. Both sides having the equal amount of firepower, so it's gonna be a three v three retake. I'm down, funneling out. KG finds one. No smoke heaven still. One enemy remaining. Big picks yeah, of the ball in right here. Oh, the and they omen. clean it up just barely. And this is not looking good for Long Island. I mean, I know they were getting on their buy round. And you got to keep in mind, this is still a bonus for Howard, no, that's definitely a very big eco round. Well, bonus round, mostly. For Howard coming into this round. Um, Long Island's going to have a rough buy coming up. Like, Absolutely, but this is where we want to see like some of these plays. The, the the thing with this comp is since it's so it's so tried and true, it's so reinforced. It is so easy to make these, these very simple plays. Obviously, I know some teams like to opt for that breach, but with the sky dog, the sky flashes, you're able to get that global pressure. I really want to see them do some more some more aggression, especially mm. with how their jets been playing. Their jets kind of had a a natural that, aggression lead. Did I just and, see a judge being picked up by someone? In our last game that I that I was here for, there was a mental athlete with the judge was coming oh, and they missed me as picking it right back up. Oh wow! Okay, Howard is just full on giving so much pressure to the seaside. The judge. We're just wasting no time. Absolutely none. You would think their omen is their entry with how fast they. Oh, Kai, that's. It's a three v two retake. 
Sky still long. Our Omen does still have a judge. They need to play this really carefully. In Long Island's defense right now, right? They have to retake this up, but they know they might need to be into a judge. Good job. Decided to dog out here. Um, but the Omen of the judge is running it down. Enemy remaining. Oh, and they miss me cleaning up with a nice forte. Could lead to an ace here. He does have to deal with Zinch. Can he? Sky seems a bit lost. Oh, still able to find the kill. That was... Wow. <laughs> if, if, if you're Long Island and you're getting ran down by this judge, I... A judge on Omen, nonetheless. I feel like there's not a lot you can really account for. I would be terrified. That was definitely... How can I say it? The experimental cop, you know, like... I, I'm pretty sure uh, Long Island did not expect an Omen judge coming into that round. Like, that was very well played by the Omen. Uh, I mean, especially... Missed. Yeah, so. especially <laughs> since, in, in their defense, maybe, you know, they might not have played against this team comp a whole lot. It looks like Long the Viper might have been quite I'm, I'm not 100% sure, but at least on a first glance it did. A very hard mid rush by Long Island, getting Locking denied side. by Howard. Really big mid fight here, and there is, with the man advantage especially, they are able to just rotate off and find pretty much a free side control. But, we do have to be careful of this man alert by Omen. Omen's been very dangerous, at least. Oh, the finding the kill, really nice shots. The Jets AJ very doubling very... back. Yeah, the Jets' awareness has been really strong so far, as well as just their ability to find the kills. AJ doubling back just in case of that last fight. And, you know, for the side of Long Island, it is a really hard retake. Especially Utah, with the it? amount of util. Mm, the error is about to come in, maybe with an open fire, but the error is like a benign. Kenny finds two. Could be big here. Kenny finds all three. Oh, Kenny is Kenny. dominating today. Okay, Kenny, you know, we see you. to find out what they fed Jack this boy Kenny. this morning. <laughs> Kenny gets like a golden star for me to be in the watch out, you know? Exactly. Yeah, we put we put some G fuel in his Rice Krispie tray. Oh. Crazy. All right. Another full by round from both sides coming in. Long Island I mean, is going to... Look at the way the picks are spread out across both teams on the scoreboard, right? And you can just tell one just looks a lot more balanced. Mm. Or, uh, Howard just coming across, they have... Very evenly spread, minus their Viper, but, you know, very evenly spread picks. And then you look on the side of, of Long Island, and it's you know, Placing alarm bomb. really strong players. And we're still looking for those picks out of the rest of them. But, we're only five rounds in. Oh, here. this KJ is about to get a lot of I've got your train. Oh, a lot of pushing coming out of here. Ultimate used by Sky. Dog. Making a better Amazing. decision this time to hop off site. Obviously, you know, they don't have them. It's probably a better idea. Oh, Especially on C, fighting C site on defense, unless you're opping and you're and you're at least double stacked on site, then you might as well pop off. Howard, Howard is deciding to play everybody else. Omen. Omen does not have to go. So let's go. Let's get spammed down. Gosh, that big one. And I mean, if if you're Long Island at this point, you kind of just start grasping at straws, you know, to find those big picks. And with seeing nobody on site, I mean, like, if you're Long Island here and you're seeing nobody on site in the garage, what are you thinking? Right now, you know everybody's long, but that KJ will come to play in the site. It's about to be a fair battle. Last player standing. There's only so much they can do, and it's just... That is so much potential. Like, Howard, the thing about Howard, right? If you look at this lineup comp of them right now, if you can't deny them getting to that site, you're going to have a hard time retaking that site, because you have to worry about Viper Mollies coming out. You have KJ Mollies on top of that. They have two flashes coming out, too. Like... Well, it's also just Howard. on the side of Howard, their their stall as well as their just like take potential is so huge. They're missing the Sova, which is probably the the advantage that Long Island isn't really taking advantage of. Um, at least on the side of defense, Howard's gonna have a lot less info. But we're really not taking advantage of the fact that our Sova is able to find the info of where this team is a lot more aggressive than their Sky will be able to. And it, it, I mean, it shows we're not finding out until they're pretty much on site hits. Howard looking to make an A presence here into the jet. Sova. Omen with a judge once again. This isn't broke, don't fix it. That is true, that is true. But of course, you've seen the jet to play today already, hitting those crucial shots, very aware of what's going on. So. 
And I mean, a, a, a lot of the cases, especially on this eco disadvantage, the, the rule of thumb, at least for me, is if you're going to play stupid, you're going to play as a team. Oh, and and, and, down mid. As well. and the only oh, issue I'm seeing right now is we're taking a bunch of one on one fights with a big eco disadvantage. And we missed our. It looks like we missed our solo. That is very unfortunate, but. Very unfortunate opening to the week. Omen with a possible big lurk. I'm sure Silva hears him. Silva hears him, calls it out. Has to be careful. Okay, Omen is just flying on the reset. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god, and that got a little bit too close. close. But we're still in the game. Big funnel back out on a B site, but we know that Howard's been playing really off site fights. And a lot of solo until, so it's going to be extremely hard to find. But balling. Oh, balling once balling. again. Bushman wants to dash in. Getting a little bit silly. We do still have the judge on the board, and this is getting really scary. Oh, wow. And unfortunately, couldn't close out the retake. I was really scared there for a minute. Our sky whipped out the judge. I thought they were going to be able to shut him down, but it does not look like it. Ballin should not be balling that much and get away with it, to be honest. But very well played by Howard University. Long Island is looking strong. It's just little mistakes that are being currently made that they need to communicate and figure out, like, hey, where we can do something better. Or play off each other's youths a little bit more, in my opinion. Snuff a lot of one ones happening. I mean, if you're on the side of Long Island, especially especially if we have a coach as Long Island, right? Mm. We really need to have to try to find that info. Big opening pick, not too sure what Howard's Omen was doing for a second. Got a little bit distracted. Maybe try to time the dart and unfortunately just got caught in the open. It's a risky, it was a risky play. You got to respect the grind, you know? You got to, yeah, you got to respect, yeah, especially gotta, gotta when, respect especially when you're on that judge omen, you know, you need to find yeah. these, these you know, not particularly normal ways Sorry. of playing the game. Um, and I mean, they are down their smokes players, so they do need to make, make do with jet smokes, which could be their downfall here. They pick out a, ooh, two picks out of Indigo. Indigo? Okay, does he know about the Kaja that, I mean, Sky that got passed? And he might have just lurked on a site, might have friend. Trigger, this is so crucial. Decides to ignore it. Could find multiple here purely off of it. Ah, oh, dang, it's dang, dang. Find two. It's two against three. Kenny. Kenny's locked in with the trigger discipline. Might have single handedly won his team this round. We need to see it. It's going to be Planted. extremely difficult, but we do have Pull still out. a bunch of solo utility. Blinded. Has the info that there's at least one C Link, knows there's none garage. An arrow up in nine seconds has a drone decides to pull it out. Double so across here could be huge. They did see the timing on the Viper, could assume that both are there. And Kenny, once again with the trigger discipline, might find another one. Can he make it? Can he find a little bit of ace from Kenny? Oh my wow. god. What a dominant performance. Kenny is getting another gold star for me, bro. Like, this is the second one I have next Kenny to Kenny really already. showing. Yeah, Kenny is definitely not making an LFT post later tonight. I'm telling you what. Uh -huh. Oh, he's standing still clipping that. I don't know. He's already Absolutely. Clip it. Clipping it. Twitter looking post. for the reactions. Hashtag Kenny. Ballard Bedway Battles coming in. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely dominant out of Kenny. Love the trigger discipline. Kenny is just AFK in spawn. He's like, all right, guys. I had so much fun. This is up to you guys now. And right. I mean, at that point, if you're Long Island, right, and you're losing these rounds to just timings, they unfortunately, a lot of them are really big timings. I'm wondering, if you're Long Island's coach, what are we, what are we thinking? Like, what do we need to say to our team to get them back on the track? Here. I, from my point of view, I would definitely say, is like, hey, guys, we need to communicate. I feel like a lack of communication. I've got your to try. To the comps right now. But, what would you say, coach? Like, from the coach perspective, I'm going to say it. Uh, well, me personally, I think we've done a very, at least on the side of Long Island, we've done a really poor job of finding out where they're playing until it's too late, almost. We, we're having our, our initiator util pretty much oh, up man. until retake slash night mix. We have no... Oh, what sketchy here. But I mean, uh, on the side of Long Island, if I'm coach, I'm just gonna say we gotta be more aggressive in our info gathering. We're not finding info until too late. And it shows yet another round from Howard. They're absolutely rolling at this point. And I mean, we either gotta call a timeout or find a way to stop this yeah, no. snowball because we're gonna lose the half at this rate. I would definitely, to, like, 
if I was in there, I'd be like, all right, let's pull a time on discuss what oh power is doing. It seems like from all the things we can see whatever is happening. It looks like they have two set plays happening, and those two set plays are working because Long Island is just not using that info that they have. They have a sky and so they could get those aggressive information like you mentioned. And I mean, yeah. it's only going to go downhill for Howard on the side of defense at least, just because their info is going to get worse, right? They're going to need to find that info. Probably the first really strong piece of three round info that we've gotten from our show here. We know there's at least two drafts leaning for a B hit. But there's two still oh. stuck up in B window. They could be playing a bit of a late. Right? Right, I'm not too sure what's going on with our omen and our KJ here. Looks like oh. we're just setting up the stall. I mean our jet has the info that they're not C. Well, it looks like and we're power was waiting for the smoke to go off. Uh, oh, is it gonna be a, a... We have the call that there be. We have the call that there be. We need to see Rotation. how they respond here. I mean, sky coming in, rotations all coming in. They know it's about to be a hit. Things are going to be Viper will be coming out. Really? Unfortunately, not able to find a Viper. Could have solidified the round here. Indigo might be able to find something. Indigo only finds one, and it's not looking strong. Stealing sight. Big potential to funnel back. But. Walking into ball and ball is balling once again. Big trade out of the jet here. The judge with the oh, omen, you just can't stop it. Last player standing. Depth and three. The judge on top. And barely doesn't close it out. So if, well put. If you're Long Sorry. Island at this point, you really need to just go more aggressively. We had two on A, not really trying to look for anything, not you know, spotting finding info. It just looks it doesn't look that good for the way of uh of Long Island right now and they really need to snap it back in. Definitely not. And that run was very well played by Long Island. They managed to get those trades coming out and of course the big play by the Jet. But unfortunately taking so much damage trying to make that play that she ended up on one HP to a judge and uh, just not not enough, you know. But as you said, maybe they listen, they're making the C aggressive play. And okay. Probably one of the best the best like early round aggressions we've seen from the side of Long Island. At least as of recent, right? And we they, have this info that we know we're not getting hit. We have the info from Sky, and I mean, we're finding out just a little bit too late, but it is better than the, ba the past few rounds that they're hitting A. A the late flank. You know, a, a late flank from Jet Sova. The Jet is aware. Balling is a little bit aware. Balling's about to ball see. out. We're about to see. Balling like Michael Jordan. Is he going to jump peek? Is it Utah going to be useful? Very unfortunate. Soba still has the op, big pick, but I mean, it really is in the hands of Howard. They have no reason. To... And then, it's a big pick out of ball in, and this guy is Shaq and Kobe domination in 2000. There's really, there is not a lot that Long Island's Last do round with one before the half. switch. At this point, we really we need to just call the timeout so we can like fix our sanity at this point because we're kind of just doing the same thing and hoping it works out. Timeout is needed to be called. I feel like for the players themselves to get some confidence. Like, at the moment, I know for a fact, you're just looking at the scoreboard and that's demotivating, you know, like as a team of five friends playing together, you're like, it's demotivating. you like, you know, like you want to be winning. If you're not winning, you're like, start being like, oh, okay, I'm a, I'm, I don't care. I'm just going to do this. I feel like that's, that's definitely an issue that Long Island's going to be facing. You know, these destroyed. rounds, they're getting <laughs> Good right, and when their strats aren't working. An operator. Okay. Big opening pick. Balling, balling once again with a C link to hit. Big potential to get some kills out of Sova and Omen here. I left alone on C. Does have the potential to pick up this operator. They don't know that he's here. Kai's going to find the pick on. I immediately traded out. Omen, Omen going deployed. nuclear, finally locking in, deciding if my team won't bring me to victory, then I'll do it myself. But uh, they're up against a strong force of the ball and, and the Viper. A, a very nice one contact enemy play. Yeah, last player the ball and... Shuts it down. And that's the thing, you know, like, very well played by Switching Howard. That's side. how you see, like, you know, like, we talked about it earlier in this, in today. Like, it's the name, you know, like, they have HU next to each other. It's just that structure, stru structure play of, like, all right, I'm going to take this fight. If I don't get it, you can trade me or be in tradable positions most of the time. 
And that was played perfection by Howard. It, it honestly, it. yeah, it shows in the it shows in the macro and the micro. Just by the way that you guys are playing out these rounds towards the end, at the beginning, you know, you can tell that there's repetition in the way that they've done these things. Yeah. Nothing, nothing is just on the fly, no thought. There is intention in everything that they've been doing. At least this half. And a very awkward Viper wall coming out of the side of Howard. Something but, I haven't quite seen before myself, but with how they've been playing, I'm sure they have a reason for it. Very fast push up C long from Sky and KJ here. Would be a very quick pinch. This timing could be everything, and any. Long Island really has to just fight it. Big picks on Howard. Long Island, I mean, they're stuck. They have to make some more happen to funnel them to from both sides. And this very, could be the first round for Long Island. Very well to play. Very good reaction from Long Island deciding to go B. They are currently stuck Spike in planted. a B side with all three angles being closed on them. Exactly. Long Island down the health advantage. Yeah, exactly. They have to play this perfectly, otherwise this round is lost. And Big pick. Sun getting the first one. He knows one is down. I finds one indigo stuck with their dog out, and it's looking like Long Island's gonna start off with a really strong pistol pump. This could be the half to bring it back. That's exactly what Long Island needed that round. It, that's a big pickup for them. Hey, well, we know this could be the big comeback, you know. 2 11 happened multiple, multiple times before they came back, but that was really well played by Long Island. Good reaction to the aggression of Howard University. You know, you can't at this point, the, the thing is, right, is Howard has nothing to lose here, right? They may they may have lost this round, but they get... I wouldn't be surprised if, it, surprised if Howard just runs it down, which it looks like they're doing automatically. They have nothing to be afraid of. And, and they miss me with a very strong opening shotgun pick. Could have gone nuclear and finding the Vandal instantly. And Howard gets a good and I mean, regardless of how you look at it, you know, they have the ability to just run it down on him, and that is a decent ego. I mean, it could have been a lot better. We could have gone nuclear with that Vandal, finding it pretty much instantly. But finding two, that's not bad. Econ, that's econ damage, and I'm pretty sure at the moment right now, um... Long Island is potentially having some players on light armor that couldn't even buy a full Utah by any chance, as you can see. Oh, yeah, look at look at the buy right now. It's all over the place for Long Island. Seeing, seeing Howard with the Bucky on their omen, I mean, like, if it was anybody other than the uh, the domination I've been seeing with this judge, I would be afraid. But I'm, I, have a, I have a strong feeling they'll be able to make something happen with it. Putting them on C, though, is a little bit questionable. Long Island. Very fast A. Aggressive A. Getting the first pick. Getting traded. Oh, we're finding I immediate two picks. I mean, this push is shut down pretty much as quickly as it started. They'd be a fool to just continue to fight in this, but will they? They know that they've rotated on. Omen is going to find an early shotgun pick. Enemy died. And Howard getting traded out immediately. Long Island somehow coming up on top. One enemy remaining. And he finds Fight the refrag. Planted. And he all he has to do is buy time for his cage to get here. That cage is gonna play the lure. Does he expect it though? Oh, the flash. Owen. And a very strong pick out of Kai. <laughs> you know, very I mean, well times like these where really just need to reassess, right? We're four, we're three twelve at this Don't point. Even start of that Howard. Shit here, mate. And there's not really any any change happening at Long Island. Match We're not flipping point. a switch. We've kind of been doing the same thing all half. Or, well, well all game, I guess. And expecting a different control. I mean, that's not insanity, but I don't know what is. That is true. Long Island is unfortunately just being read like a book by Howard. Oh, mm -hmm. actually playing Howard's playbook. You know, like, Howard might just be playing their playbook to perfection right now. Like they are, they've taken full control of this entire game. It's like, hey, we want to do this. This is what's gonna happen, and it's have been happening, you know. They haven't had one. I've got your trail. <laughs> Plan yeah, that'll work out for them. They, like, they so. really, they really have not been switching up it as much. And I mean, now we have this this strong C lane, at least from what it looks like. And it looks like Long Island's gonna turn this into a B hit. 
right here. Finding a very early pick. Probably the best pick we could have found in that situation. Balling. We'll be balling out again. Let's see. Omen with a very Omen. aggressive pick. Finds one and Spike the twins are immediate. Oh. 3v3, 3v2. Down to a 2v1. One twins are instant, instantaneous. But it is, it is the sim. It is a 1v1 Viper. One is the boom. Howard looking a little bit nervous almost. But I mean, it's 3 12. Nothing to be afraid of. They win this round, they win the game. They don't. They come right back at it. And I'm pretty My sure Long ready. Island. Come on. Gonna be broken Get regardless. Out of my way. Oh, the ulti being passed. Well, and Sam oh, taking it back. Me. Well played. Long Island's not ready to go Just yet. They're really not ready to go yet. Big clutch, you know. Big, big, big clutch. Again. Little Pepsi clutch out of junk book simp here. And I mean, realistically, <laughs> 412. I have extra money if anyone needs. There's nothing to be afraid of on the side of power, especially. We get a few econ rounds in. Got to be a little bit charitable, you know. Get a little charitable donation. Going on. Make it a charity event. And then we're right back at it. Finish off the run. That has to be a good big confidence boost for Long Island. Oh, just at least a little bit, you know. Like, they're like, hey, guys. We can do this. You know, like, we're just as good as they are. But Ballin, is he going to? Are we going to see Balling, the... Ballin could dunk out here. Looks like the Sky Dog's going to clear him. And he is in a very dangerous spot. They are him, but they're very dangerous. The wall could actually save him here. And he finds one with the sheriff. Very strongly to pick. They don't clear both sides. Oh and my god. And Bali doesn't, doesn't find either. And oh, oh my god. What a heartbreak. You're gonna, gonna hate to watch that one back in the bot as a coach later. I'm gonna be honest with you. There is no notes Spike I could planted. give a player on that one other than going out. Very unfortunate. That is, that's exactly what Long Island needed, let's be honest. That Long is a heartbreaker. We really were banking on luck at that point, remaining. hoping something happened, and they got exactly what they needed. Really unfortunate. That could have won them the game single-handedly. That, that, that was the winning play move, but unfortunately, it is Valorant. Blinded. Anything can happen, and that just happened. I mean, we've seen it before. <laughs> we've seen it before, we'll see it again. I mean... On a bigger scale, we're looking at Fnatic Loud, right? I mean, anything can happen. 412, it's unheard of. But if anybody can do it, Long Island might as well be able to. Do it today, you know. Showers, they have it in them, you know. And it's starting. It, it went from F312, 512. It's, it's all or nothing, you know. Like, they have to give it everything they got, and they have been. Like, that's a really big round for Long Island confidence boost but like this is probably going to be one of the biggest rounds yet to come for us you know full by both squads and operator was on the field if i wasn't mistaken you know it's one round right and if you're howard honestly there shouldn't be much of a worry anyways we put the op on the board you know ballin's been having a really strong Ballin game so far on the op on b exactly number uh, six is the, the off angle blood. crutch cannon is coming out really strong right and i mean especially in the hands of ballin this point and click adventure weapon is going to bring us home. At least in my eyes, I think the potential here is very strong. You, but if, sorry, do you think they know Bolin has an operator right now? I think it's safe to assume. Especially with the econ. Unfortunately, he has given away that he has an op now. And by this point, it should be safe to assume that they're not going to push me to that one. Not at all. They're speeding it up for a C hit. They know there should be less players. And they've taken control of the AJ deciding to fight on site. Unfortunately, couldn't find the pick on. Uh, I'm just going to call it Jet just because you know, it's, it's quite an But very strong on, on site fights. Elman Elman jumping out. Getting two. Getting two. I'm through somehow. And the, and the retake of the is still possible. The retake so is very know? strong. Oh, he's being loud and way coming. too much noise. Omen's going to be able to find this pick here. Player standing. Viper oh, no, cleans it up, Viper. and now all they have to do is buy time. Which is clueless. And Kenny wraps it up. They do need to remember to grab this op on the board. Oh, never mind. It's GG. It's I forgot. And Howard bringing it to a close. Never really losing their footing with any lead they had all half, all game. Just a Definitely very strong not. performance out of Howard. Very dominant performance, if, to say the least. Very well played by Howard University.
I'm gonna have to give a little call out to my boy Kenny. Like, I don't know Kenny, but Kenny the plays was, he was made today. a dominant performance out of Kenny. Hey, Kenny, and Kenny Molly, was having yeah. a very dominant performance. And I mean, going oh. into this next map, especially if you're Long Island, you really need to find a way to bring it back, especially with the momentum. We need to find a way to flip a switch and go into the next one with our heads strong. Which, yeah. I, I was about to say, and if we going in, talk about the next match, and then it's gonna be a bit of a break. Happy days. <laughs> Happy days, indeed. And I believe next map should be a Lotus, which is a very interesting one. You know, I haven't seen that one played in a minute, as well as willingly played. It's one of my least favorite maps. Um, Out of the side of Long Island, which maybe we might see a bit more of a strong performance with them, especially starting out on defense. Uh, it is a notoriously attacker-sided map, but Long Island did seem to do a bit better when they got their um, their footing in, maybe they can start a momentum off a little bit earlier. We'll see. We'll see. Definitely, we'll definitely be able to see that as soon as we come back after this break. You know, good happy happy days. battles coming back in with long island and howard going into that lotus game which looks like howard's going to be starting off on attack for a little bit interested how do we think this one's going to go to well how's it you know it's going to be back uh definitely very good showing from howard on the first map on haven moving into lotus like you said um i think we're about to see another good set of games coming out with howard potentially running how I would like to say, experimental comp into Long Island. Probably going to be running our meta comp. Meta is meta. But... Meta is meta, and they have proven that they are not afraid to use it. However, Howard coming out strong with the off meta comps, I'm interested to see what they can do again. At least from the hovering, it's looking pretty safe on the side of Howard. Honestly, Long Island looking like they're running more of an experimental comp. I personally not a big fan of running Harbor Viper, but I have seen it run. It does work pretty well. Oh wow, this is this is out of my knowledge apparently. Like I really haven't been watching. Of course, I I've been watching games and stuff, 
Fnatic and all those things, but Armor Viper. That's a Armor. a very coordinated team to make it work, which Long Island could be. You know, like I'm I'm not doubting them one. You never bit. know. I'm. This was right. their map pick. They could be a little bit more comfortable on this. I personally, I'm a bigger fan of having like a a dedicated main controller as well as either Harbor or Viper being the secondary. But I mean, at least on the side of Howard, their comp looks a lot more like something I'd run than at Choose least over your agent. Side of Long Island, at least for right now. That is true. I do. I do see like the default race coming in with a um, Sky and KJ. Um, I do like. The Omen Viper, which is more traditional, like you said. Um, excited to see how this harbor comes into play. Definitely looking forward to like how they bring this agent into this map, set him up for success, or how the harbor sets up his team for success, you know? And I mean, you know, <laughs> Long Island coming back out with the matching, matching oh uh, my cards as yes. well. Hopefully it brings them a little bit more luck this time than it did last time. But I mean... With Harbor, at least on defense, your ability to take map space is a lot stronger, honestly. You're more of a threat, at least with these fast, you know, early mid-takes, early main-takes, whatever it may be. Um, I'm, I'm interested to see how they counter it on the side of Howard. Howard's been really dominant recently. Um, but I'm very excited. Both teams are on the chopping block for this one. You know, winner takes it all. This is, this is the decider match, so... You know, there's a lot of pressure on the board, and both teams need to keep their mentals out of the gutter. The, the worst thing that can happen on either side right now is, you know, somebody tilting, somebody deciding they just want to run it down, or some bad plays coming out. So we'll see how it goes. Looking like a, I'm gonna start off pretty strong with a pistol run, and we'll see. We'll see where it goes from there. Pretty big B lean off rip though on the side of. Uh, All right. And for everybody joining us, we have Howard University versus Long Island. This is map two, Lotus. Howard University up 1 0, taking us to a strong B hit into the KJ of Long University. And the downside gets one, and he gets two. He gets unfortunately destroyed by the boom box. Fallen, finding that immediate refrag. Fallen, tracking Kobe domination. I got eyes here. Spike down, see. Past few games. Very strong immediate trades from Long Island, and they're looking like a different team. One enemy remaining. Yes, that was a good start for Long Island, and Long Island will be taking. Round number one against Howard University. I, I have to agree. Another that looked like a brand Please new. Light. Maybe, Let's maybe some. So, you know, what did, okay, you as a coach, what do you think happened in the locker room from between I feel last like map and this map? The pressure really set in for them. They they probably realized that this is the decider. There is no room to mess up. Right? It's not about what uh, you're feeling uh, in the moment. Nobody cares if you're tilted. The only time people care is whether or not you win or lose. Nobody cares about the in between. And need to step up and show that. And it looks like they're coming in with a, a different fire, a different passion, knowing that they have to leave everything out there because nobody's going to care otherwise. Oh, very, very strong well ceiling said. start. They have the space already at a Long Island. They know they have to be leaving. We're going to find out a little bit late. At least from just the uh, the face checking with Harbor, we know there's a few there. Harbor, I think I think Harbor is still somebody. Pulling ready to put the wall up. Wall is up. Uh, is Howard going to execute into this? Oh, they're just waiting for a pick. I mean, on the side of eco disadvantage, they need to be pushing together. It looks like they're just gonna walk out. They go finding one here. They go big off of the eco frags. Finds... Ooh, and Kai gets the refrag. But I mean, they're isolated on site. They're only to scroll over to help them. Not too cool. One enemy remains. The eco is dropping left, right, and center, and the eco is not gonna be damaged at all on the side of Long Island. Omen kind of grasping at straws here. Really needs to make something work. A lot of Yuko being used just to find the Omen well played by the Viper of Long Island. Getting I mean, another Omen round. Still some, yeah, still somehow finds one. Not a terrible eco round on the side of Howard. Howard now on their buy round. Gonna flip a switch. We see the, the infamous judge on the side of the Omen. And I'm curious. I mean, Lotus is a bit bigger of a map. And it's harder to get into those little uh, those crevices where the judge would really shine without getting shut down. Do we think that there's going to be any value out of this judge? Like you said, getting value off his judge is going to be extremely hard as he has to get to close range quarter to at least make a play with it. But with the team that Howard University has, they are they do have the ability to set him up. It's just going to take precise gameplay from each from his teammates and coordination, which it might come in with. Well, he's for the Viper's leg. 
full execution coming from Howard University. And a very late healer. KJ could find the timing and kill Viper here. It's very possible. It's one good oh my double God, big Huge damage. And I mean, even if they don't have the picks here, Howard has full sight control. And going into this retake, regardless of if it's even, Zach could find the opening pick to the side. Oh, the line up and they find the trade out, and Harvard is all of a sudden at the disadvantage. Guns, get in Just the double. Kidding. They miss me, finds two. And oh, right back at it with the knife out again. You know, I'm, I'm starting to think we're the this coach on the side of Howard. We need, we need to take away these knife skins, but I don't think default is going to no. stop us. This would be oh, insane. My oh my god, and we're going for it anyways. And they find four waffle blood. Someone type GG in the chat. I'm sorry, somebody said type GG in that This chat. is Valorant. Oh. This is Valorant oh tried and true. It's not possible. I can't be. Uh, I cannot be asked. If I were oh. Long Island at this point, there's just no way. There's there's no VOD reviewing this, seeing the full like full blind omen double kill. I'm, I'm not doing that. Was he fully blinded by his own teammate well, as well? I'm pretty blind. sure it was by his own teammate and he somehow Here. gets to that is that's menace. This omen is I will be their making meta. I, 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 I'm telling you, people are going to project review this, and then in my rank games, you'll be finding these plays happening. Oh, very well played by them. Howard University coming back strong into this round. But of course, now this round is the most important round, you know? Both sides full by. I mean, we've, we've left B pretty much up for grabs at this point. And I mean, if we're on the side of Long Island, we know that we've run the same defense setup. So we have to expect that at some point, they're going to start playing a little bit differently. But out right. of the side of Howard, they're just kind of running it, running it in. A lot of Utah being used to get in. Land, made. I mean, it doesn't matter if they get this site. Yeah, and they, they may not have any ults to play off of, but Howard's been really dominant with their refrags. Their trades have been pretty much perfect, at least for the past map. Spike I'm very excited to see how they fight for this. Long Island has to retake the site, knowing there's a judge in play, knowing that Viper Utah is there for post play with the KJM already. Same story as what we did. An omen with the judge could go nuclear here again. Very big potential. Uh, like, Followed by two. An omen jumps in and finds three like there's no tomorrow. Randy Orton dunking off of the fucking top rope. It is ridiculous today. Oh, it's an RPO! <laughs> you know, really, really hoping I don't find a, uh, a find in my DMs later tonight, ladies and gentlemen. But we'll see how it goes. A little bit worth if I get my one, my one F reviews per match. We'll see. And of but, course, I mean, the team. At this point, you got to be honest with yourself. You're getting dunked on by a judge several rounds in a row. What do we do at this point? What, what is the, what is the, the switch that we flip so we can avoid getting Dazner for the rest of the game? Long Island, same as what they should maybe do on Haven, though, is get that more aggressive, get it in their faces instead of waiting for them to get in yours. Because the thing is, once you've given them that sight, the retake is up against Order Judge, Molly. It is very hard to retake run. against the Utah of Howard University. But, is that it? Oh, it's even KJ. They're holding it to the last minute. It is going to be a B take, of course. Very and fast to be taken. Omen has been known to just going flying in at this point. Wouldn't be surprised to see them just jump out again. He locks it down. Gets Very one. dangerous. Definitely gonna just jump out of the smoke here. Wouldn't be surprised. Opting to play a little bit more passive than normal. Probably got yelled at by their coach. You know, we got a little bit too much dunkage going on. But I mean, I'm here to see it. I want to see them run it down like LeBron if, if LeBron was playing against a bunch of middle schoolers. And I mean, there it is. Oh, but can you find the kill instead? One enemy remaining. Up to... All in here somehow saves this team and a very strong round out of Howard. They're looking like they flipped the switch and they're back to play. I mean, Howard's both teams play. very impressive the way that they managed to just, you know, stop the snowballing and come back. No, that's true. Very well played by both teams. Uh, Long Island University is now coming in with sort of a half buy into this full buy of Howard University. Certainly... They figure out something like maybe util wise of how they can take out this omen you know get some info before they enter these sites if they're going to be playing retake because this omen has been shown to be dangerous with this judge of him his or her i i, I cannot assume i i personally don't know this place, but it's crazy how much value this omen has been getting. this omen's been getting some pretty crazy numbers on the board especially with a eight hundred dollar gun Regardless of whether or not 
they're on eco or they're on a buy round i mean the judge it fits in regardless i mean their their total loadout oh, comp, like cost is roughly the same as the rest of their teams it's a trade at the back the i find one on, on sky and i mean an immediate trade out by ballin you know the refrags out of Howard have been something to rave about, at least for the past Look at the map. Long Island wanted to rotate, but Omen, I'm pretty sure, got picked up by the Boomba just a bit too late, giving Long Island that information that, like, hey, they're still coming C, but how are you I mean, and our Vipers have... very late. We're not able to make any plays here until our, uh, you know, the rest of our team comes to site. Harder could find big picks here. Very early spam finds oh, one. Very well Gets Viper low as well. Coming in. And we're all coming in. If, if you're Omen, fight. you need to double back and, and help your team at this point. I mean, you're down the man advantage as well. And here comes the beauty of Harbor. We have that coat. We can just stick, and it doesn't matter. Omen's it is on the side with the judge. One finds remaining. one, finds two. Oh. And he TPs away. Oh, and oh my god. Howard with another close round. Something that honestly looked unlosable from the side of Long Island. I mean, at this point, I'm speechless. I'm, I'm not too sure. 13 and 2 from the side of They Miss Me on Howard University. And I mean, that's got to be a scholarship energy. raise yeah, at no. that point. So for the, for the people that did miss that, that was a 3v2 retake. You had a cope on the bomb, right? That was a secure win almost for Long Island University. But the raise of Howard University and the omen of the judge, you know, rocket into the cope, gets the pick. Well, does the damage, scares him off the bomb into the Omen Judge. Time out. That's wild. Very well played by Howard University. That was textbook retake on the bomb that they planted, you know, like, that's wild. Very well played. But... Very Long strong Island. opening. And I mean, the KJ on the side of Long Island is a Not a whole lot. We need to find these aggressive effects. But I mean, it's shotgun v shotgun. And I mean, they miss me. has been notorious with it. You can't match. Another pick. And I mean... If you're Long Island here at this point, you just need to put an op on the board to try to catch this kid. There's Lovely. not a lot we can do. Oh, all Very right, good all awareness. Right. Some Kinda might looks... say even. Uh, I was about, bro, I, I'm happy you say that. I, I was about to be like, you know, that like, kind of looks a little. Let's uh, let's issue the report. One enemy remaining. Nice Kai. Big pick out of Kai, and I mean it's one v three. Not a lot you can do here. That's but I mean, they have the awareness. Big pinch, 3k. 2 HP clutch has to be an ace for them to win it out. Is being pinched currently from both sides. Bomb is being taken off and... Balling closes it out. I mean, Howard really found their foothold after they slipped for a little bit there, but they're back. You know, still they're looking like that dominant team we saw in Haven. But, I mean, 15 and 3 out of the Omen is kind of ridiculous. My boy Kenny not really doing quite as much as he did last game, but he doesn't... Kenny is I mean, just taking the back seat to the judge show. That's all that's been happening. Exactly. Right now. We're we're just along for the ride at this point. But one thing I'm noticing, at least out of the side of Howard, is they're way more team oriented. One play one player does not need to do all the work. Which that at least from true. the side of Long Island, they are relying a lot more on individualistic plays. Is Viper? Yes, this is the kind of play Long Island needs to make. Do they clear this corner, Howard University? Very they... common corner. Uh and they do big awareness and i mean you know i was expecting an orb to go up or something to you know, draw some kind of attention there's only so much you can really expect with, with nothing being pulled aside. and that's again 4v5 retake long and alley the university back to the uh, yeah, find two. Yeah, finds one but it gets straight by the viper on the lurk I mean, and now it's a 4v2 oh a spray on the body getting a little bit disrespectful here Last player Bolin. standing. Hi. Bolin, I finds one on Indigo. I mean, there's not really a lot you can do here. If, if you're Grex, at this point, I feel like you just save. You gotta I fall mean, back. You you know these teams are gonna be pushing you and rushing you down. And they especially are. After that, I mean, there's only so much you can do. And Bolin closes it out again. You know, oh. At this point, there needs to be a, a timeout. At some point, there needs to be a timeout. We have, we have these timeouts. They're not just you know, fancy little paperweights. We can use them. Nobody's, I'm nobody's pretty, gonna yeah, take advantage of it. I'm pretty sure the tournament allows timeouts. Like, uh, I'm not... Yeah, no, they, they, they allow it. It's, I mean, at yeah. this point, it's just a matter of if they want to use them. And right now, that's my best bet. We, we really need to flip a switch because we're not finding a counter within these 20 seconds of a buy phase. We're not using them. Let's make some chaos. I'm really excited to see them flip the switch and get back, you know, in momentum. 
So Alan's gonna fight into Howard that is trying to make an A some A person and that nade definitely does a little bit of damage, hopefully. But the omen Luke where he is 10 omen seconds. Finding yet in. Another another pick. Oh, oh, oh my, no. my god, and it's it is basically just a vacuum cleaner. They're getting inhaled at this point. There's not a lot you can do. Spike planted. That is very unfortunate. I I, I don't know how to look from the POV from the sky, but that's gonna have to be frustrating. I mean, at this point, you kind of just have to expect that this omen is going to keep doing these aggro plays. AG might be able to find some value here. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a miscom on the side of Harbor. One enemy remaining. Do they Five know? One. Do they know? Oh, I mean, he's got a Bucky. There's not a lot you can really do. And, and it's going to be over just as quick as it started. Oh, big dink out. Backing up to the teammates, and they're about to uh, Avengers yeah, roll back, out on this guy. Oh, Indigo actually shutting down the shotgun demon here. Like, hey, oh, I get two, two, two get three. three. Oh, and unfortunately, God. couldn't go any further. But I mean, out of an eco, that is probably the best you could have expected. That's very, very, well very that. strong kills out of out of Indigo here. Can I get this? And I mean, that was looking Thanks. like pre nerf Bucky at that point. I would say it's good econ damage, but remember, this Omen is doing so much damage with a thousand eight hundred dollar gun. He's saving I mean, and, so much econ, that's the and thing. And also, yeah, and, and I mean, also you got to think about it. In the long run, their teammates can just buy their omen instead, and their omen can buy them the rifle. And I mean, that's saving them I don't know how much. True. But long Island like really needs to find a, a way to shut this down. I mean, it is an attacker-sided map, but they're not giving them the opportunity. They're being aggressive. They, they want to get into their faces. They were like, all right, time to come fight. Let's see the phase oh. off. Omen gets taken down instantly. I mean, that was the, the Avengers level threat. We we are capable of winning this round with any instant trade out. And I mean, Dax really is running back forward. Back to do. So getting... And Balling dodges the dog. And Let the dogs out, three. indeed. It is really unfortunate. Fire I mean, in you know, Howard has a lot of, uh, a lot of issues with the knife blast. It's scaring me. Balling oh, finds yeah. one. And I mean, B site's pretty much. Look at, the Viper, how they traded Look at the possible pinch they could find here. If Indigo plays this well, there is find a lot of value. Unfortunate. Ballin shuts it down. Viper might be able to find something here. And Howard closes it out again. Really, at this point, the best thing you can pray for is a 3 That is true, that is true. And the thing is, it's not the Long Island thing at that game. It's like... That was the right play. Like, they finally made the right play, but Howard is just so good at figuring out what's going on and replaying into the problem they had. Like, they were like, okay, these guys were aggressing. All right, cool. So what did we do? We just flashed ourselves back out, you know? Like, they're, taking, they're so good at retaking control of the situation ahead, you know? I mean, the issue is, right, is Long Island's getting the right idea. They have a really good, good idea of fighting off rip. They found the pick on the omen, but Howard seems to have shut down their aggression. Finds a dink on Zach through the wall. They're taking I'm, I'm just, I'm just quickly writing that on my notebook. Oops. Spam. Wall. Spam wall. Get random dink. Dog comes back through. And I mean, they have to put man advantage into this. But this is well played. Play. Long, Long Island has so many people there. Well played. They I mean, big trades out of both sides, and they eight. don't have to worry about the judge on the board. We do still have dog. Don't be afraid to use it. I mean, the man advantage, Long Island. This is one of those unlosable rounds that we cannot throw away. Look out! Give me some credit. They might be there. You have the harbor all the way at sea. If they do try and rotate with a KJ, exactly. If we're OB. if we're harbor in this situation, we need to be taking some kind of space. Maybe get up into this little crevice by mound with our judge instead of just you know waiting because we have no info if they rotate. If they just cut noise and sit. We have no clue. That and I mean, our KJ as well. We have nothing to work with here. Which Long Island might be their downfall. They're left. not careful. Howard could find some easy picks here off of Kai getting a lot of you, though. Yeah, they know. You they know. The KJ you also. KJ giving up the position. Place in the turret. One enemy remaining. Find one. AT. Kenny able to close it out. That's Kenny right. finds Kenny two. And now they have to left. respect the ulti from the KJ. Spike and I mean, left. Kenny left. putting up an ace last. Let's one. put up another one. This one, we do have flash on the board. Very bold play. Needs to bank on them not sticking the bomb. Long, I don't know. Where can he's at? Any quick move here? 
you need to get the perfect read on this. Oh, that's the kill. Okay. One enemy remains. Gets, gets the killer, but more than enough time. I mean, you know, really unfortunate, and that is the strength hey, of Harbor. We have that code, and that's something that we alive. really needed to play perfectly. Last that one round where we lost the to the, to the, you know, the no, vacuum so cleaner on the homie. Nice and I mean, that. Team Ace nonetheless, but we, we really need to finish this off in a 4 8 if we want any hope of bringing it back. And there's no reason not to. Long Island, four big, big ultis coming into this round. They could potentially play a retake. They could even be aggressive. You know, it's, it's, this is the ball is in Long Island's hand for how they want to play this round. I, I definitely want to see them getting a little bit more aggressive. That seems to have been the biggest issue with them, at least. Or even there's not enough aggression, right? Especially yeah. on defense side, not taking that space. Omen seems to be even more aggressive than the duelists. You know, some might say they might be a Omen is the player duelist. on a smoke's roll. Yeah, I mean. They're getting in there. They are taking that space. They are not afraid of anything. And I mean, with that judge too, so many mid-range fights, you know, you got to be wondering, what's the top one? Now we're getting into sight. It is falling. You have the Omen on top of the shotgun. Omen just everywhere. Down on Harbor. Indigo <laughs> caught with their ults out. And I mean, Long Island lost this round just as quick as it started. Oh, and now it's, a, it's all of a sudden just a... And Omen might be able to single handedly keep this round safe. Oh, man. Omen Look shutting them down man. once again. This point. Heartbreaker. Switching sides. So many, so many opportunities. And I mean, I'm sure Long Island can see what they need to do to counter this. And I know that they have ideas, but I mean, it's just so hard to put those plays into practice and it shows i mean howard's reacting to everything almost perfectly and well played by howard playing their play it's, it really does look like we're just playing how howard university wants to match these plays long you island know, is yep uh you know it's no you're fine. Uh, the judge coming out, I mean, they've been pretty much Dazner's all half, and I, I wouldn't be surprised if they continue to do it this half. But you got to be, you got to be feeling the pressure on the side of Long Island. Like, this is your map, map point, you know. Um, you need to start putting some rounds in the board, or else you're going home. And I mean, whether it be a, a team on scholarship or a, just a, you know, fun esports club. Nobody wants to go on the loser, and everybody wants to win. So, I mean, I'm, I'm interested to see how they bring it back. They really need to start, you know, putting something up there. And they start off with a really strong C tank almost immediately. Very big opening picks. Allen finds one with the, with the, with the Roomba, and it's just very sketchy. Kenny finds another. Last player standing. Gonna get perfect. free. Kenny is telling them, no, no, this is my site, and you're going home. And that is exactly what happened. Howard, a really big opening this round. And at this point, Don't if you're a fan or a coach or a player at Long Island, it's looking scary. This is definitely a point. Like, that was a very crucial round for Long Island, which they unfortunately lost. Like, now they disadvantage with guns. They had a disadvantage with um, rounds. They had a disadvantage with kill to death ratio. Like, this is a and I mean, very hard situation for Long Island at this point. At the end of the game, I mean, the numbers are going to speak for themselves. This Omen's got like 100 of the first place, at least from what we've seen here. So many first kills coming out of Omen. Opting for a Bucky over a Judge this time. Not sure if that's just an eco choice or if we're a, we're a bigger fan of the Bucky today, but been an absolute killer with this shotgun. I'm, I'm curious to see how uh, Long Island's going. And they and he knows what angles is favored to him. And uh, let's see, this is Boomba. Boomba should come back again, right? Which uh, they're not going to see there. They're going to start a clear one. Find two. Really God, and this could be dangerous for Long Island. Find three, but that value is under One enemy remaining. AJ just running it down. Fight not really has to be afraid of anything. Fight your low. And there's the bonus one. We're on that, the bonus. 311. It's hard it's hard not to call out little mistakes, but before the Viper died out, unfortunately, like they had the util to clear that corner. They get that free big kick on that omen. Like, Long University it's, definitely need to 
figure out useful was, like how they want to use it. I feel like there was there was definitely a, a, a lack of an idea for what they were doing. But I mean, at the same time, sometimes it's worth just using that extra util to guarantee things are safe. Because I mean, just the boombot, we're running into a shotgun, we don't have the guns to clear it. We can't wallbang anything. But we're coming back strong on our buy round. I mean, we have no ults to work with. We do have the gun advantage. I'm interested to see how they're going to play it. We should have that confidence to be able to take those fights with the running shotgun. You know, they like to get close, has to be careful. Ellen finds two! Almost three! And I mean, the damage is already done. They're pushing into a judge. They need to get out as fast as possible. And just jump out onto them. And Ellen shuts them down. And at this point, if you're Long Island, I mean, I'd be building at this point. Getting run down by the Hoover vacuum thing, it's just... I'm ready to see those guys the POV is going to be so It's got to be a it's got to be a Das Nerf compilation like it, it's it's going to be so cool. Like it's, <laughs> it's you know if you use this part of the of the game from you know Valorant Baldway Battle go crazy bro like that's that's sick. I love seeing it. Like I'm I'm all here for it, you know. Like, ah, I mean wild. you know if if it's not broke don't fix it. And I mean that that's yeah, it's been a recurring theme. They've been using the judge since even Falling, not getting scanned by this flash. Finds one. Five with an immediate refact. Finds three. Spike down. C. Round is basically over. And I mean, if you're KJ at this point, one HP needs to find something. Omen can just one tap you from across the map. A little bit of funny business, and they close it out. Howard. Howard. Universe. Are your winners. Going through to the single elimination bracket, which I assume is next week. And then, unfortunately, I mean, this is the last time we will be seeing Long Island University for the Valorant Baldway Battles for 2023. I mean, you know, it was it was a good showing. You know, props to both teams. Respect for coming out. I mean, but at the end of the day, that judge might be the sing <laughs> single handedly the reason why we need to nerf it. But yeah, uh, I can I can definitely see the Twitter post coming out from Howard University praising the judge. Absolutely. Um, but it's been a wonderful showing today. Glad to, glad wonderful. to have been here. No, definitely. Well played to both teams. It was great to watch them. And once again, thank you so much, Lumi, for... Of course. Thank you for joining. having me. Thank and, you. And well, thank you for being here as well. Yeah, no, I was about to say, I, I'm pretty sure I didn't have you, and I didn't, you didn't have me, but, you know, we had each other, you know, and it yeah, was yeah, fun. It's, it's, really all about, it's all about the memories <laughs> we made along the way. And then but, thanks uh, yeah, so much for everybody a... else joining. And then shout out to all the sponsors. All the support you guys have been given. Big uh, big ups to Pepsi, a bunch of Pepsi aces today. Pepsi aces, um, as they well as Nano Leaf. I personally use Nano Leaf in my room. Hashtag not sponsored, but <laughs> making, making but no. my room look pretty good. I think we're stretching it out here a little bit, but yeah, no, definitely. And wonderful. I, I... Look forward to seeing everybody again. And then good luck to all the teams going forward. And that'll be us for tonight. Cheers, everybody.